I had a bag of a long time, no see location. At least in my case, on this very warm December day. The temps are in the 70s right now, or at the very least around 70. But to the east, what appears to be a CSX work vehicle. Not what I was hoping for, but I'll take what I can get. At least it's on the track, I'm not driving alongside it. But the gates aren't going down. All right, horn action. There, I gave you some. I gotta try that one day. Get train wheels on my car. That's train wheels, not training wheels. I guess since that thing's going westbound, it'll be a while before something comes eastbound. Or there'll be a head-on collision. So, I guess I'll try my luck here at Martin. It's also a degree or two warmer here at Martin than it was there by CSX at White Marsh. Hopefully those distant CPLs tell us something's about to happen. About to get some newfangled LED headlights. Can I get that from my bike? The block signal just went red. That tells you it's functioning. See you in Boston. And now time for some southbound action. A silly, all right. Just love those sillies. And so does she. Now for some CSX. For sure this time.
place. One of those juicy jobs. How about some juicy juice? I could use some juice right about now, of a different kind. Oops, too much information. And now here by a very foggy Bush River. Today was rather humid, so I guess that's why the river is all foggy. Hoping for some action here as well. Over the foggy northeast corridor. There's a foggy one for you there. But look up there. No more osprey nest on that antenna there. Did the ospreys defunct it themselves? Or did mankind go up there and take it down? And now my next location with distant sirens, if you can hear them. Hmm. Nice lighting effects this time of the evening. Good they got facilities here, huh? If you're a woman, it comes in handy. And it appears we're about to get more LED action. Hold on to your hats. Cool fog there. wasn't so bad that time. My hat stayed on. And my next location. A town that my family once owned half of. Well, a quarter of whatever. One fifth of. True story. Already something northbound. Kind of being a silly. Looks like a two headed earthworm. And in about ten minutes, the mark should arrive. Now for something southbound. And I've raided all moments on the northeast corridor. Well, almost never. Wasn't ready for that one. And that one almost did blow my hat away. And 
something approaching out of the south. I bet it's the mark we're waiting for. I hear brakes and a bell. Yeah, I'll take an ice cream. What's happening in there? Okay, time to depart. See you in Perryville. Oops, not this time. Well, now that I got you some trains, I'll try and get you some Christmas lights here by what we call the Gingerbread Village. They go all out here every year. No, they don't go half out, they go all out. Let's find some more. Some there in the distance. Almost impressive there. And there. Nothing there. Back in our original house. Almost like a village here. I just put the word gingerbread in there to make it sound neat. But don't give me their electric bill. It's the last thing I want. Just turned around heading back out. Apparently lots of folks come to see these displays. And there's the big one. Very impressive. And probably equally expensive as it is impressive. As I said, don't give me their electric bill. But there you have it. Merry Christmas. Okay, who watching this wants the electric bill?
were some more displays, but not as impressive as what we just saw back there. Well, some colorful stuff here. Anything happening here in Baldwin? No, not really. Today's gas price. Although down around our way, it's less expensive than that. Like 30 cents less expensive. So don't buy your gas in Baldwin. Not passing through Glenarm. A former Mom Pi Railroad locality. And the former Mon Pa station over here, now disused. Well, it's more lights there. Got a wet road. There was a side street up here where they used to string lights across the road once upon a time. Could this have been the road? Oh, I guess they still do it. Not across the road, but in their yard at least. Here, put the window down to give you a better look. But they would one time put them across the road as well, right up here. And for a while they stopped doing that, but apparently doing it again. And some further up there as well. Stringy lights, how about that? Well, some hanging over the road there. Kind of, sort of. Let there be light. But again, don't send me their bill. But now back in suburbia. Not a lot of lights to be had around here. I think I'll end it here. Hope you all enjoyed. I well, don't know what else to say.